The First Amendment is being or could be shredded by some of the governors on this right to protest stuff. What do you got there, Barry? What's going on? Well, the First Amendment to the Constitution, which starts the Bill of Rights, is so critical that the founders put it first. And they gave us the birthright of freedom of speech, freedom of assembly, and freedom of protest. They gave us the actual right to request changes from our government. That is a right that they can't take away. I mean, they, the governors, and yet they are doing it. Barry, so, uh, when, what are some of the examples of this? Well, for example, if you're upset that your business in, say, Los Angeles has been shut down, you're allowed to go out and hold up a sign and say, Governor Newsom, change this. Mayor, change this. City council, change this, and so on. That's the right to protest. The right to assemble is the ability to get a bunch of your fellow citizens together to say, hey, this isn't okay. When the governors literally make that illegal, they're overruling the Constitution. This has never happened before. And the question is, who will decide whether you have your First Amendment rights anymore? Barry, let me ask the you something. Governor, you're you're the one mayor. of the best known attorneys in the country. I've got to ask you two questions here. One, the right to assemble, and two, uh, the right to protest. When these people are being arrested, when they get arrested, are they going to have a constitutional case coming out of this on the back end? And if so, are there damages? Huge. Huge. Now, don't forget, there, there's the old adage they teach you in law school that, well, you have the right to freak, uh, sorry, speak freely, but that doesn't give you the right to yell fire in a movie theater, right? So there's certain times that freedoms can be restricted for the public good. That's what's going to be tested here. Now, what's curious is in many cases, the people that are assembling and calling on fellow citizens to assemble are saying, wear your mask, stay six feet apart, keep social distancing, but show the governor, show the mayor, show the city council that you're protesting. And in many cases, even that is now being ruled illegal. I predict at some point when it gets to the courts, the courts will side with the people and the Constitution.